Okay, the next topic is that is electrochemical series. The next topic is electrochemical series. Electrochemical series is also called as EMF series. That is EMF series or activity series. Electrochemical series is also called as EMF series or activity series and it is very important topic and it is a very important topic for board and entrance examination. Is it clear? It is the most important topic, it is one of the most important topic in the chapter electrochemistry that is electrochemical series. Are you ready? Okay, let us start with the electrochemical series. What is electrochemical series? Electrochemical series is an arrangement of various elements in the increasing order of their standard reduction potential. Is it clear? It is the, it is the arrangement of, it is the arrangement of various elements in the increasing order of increasing order of their standard reduction potential it is the arrangement of various elements in the increasing order of their standard reduction potential is called electrochemical series or emf series or activity series is it clear what is electrochemical series it is the arrangement of it is the arrangement of various elements in the increasing order of their standard reduction potential is it clear okay any doubt this is called electrochemical series that is the arrangement of various elements in the increasing order of standard reduction potential this can also be uh, said that that is the arrangement of various elements in the decreasing order of standard reduction potential is also called electrochemical series that is a series can take from the top to bottom or bottom to top is it clear this is electrochemical series here I am writing the electrochemical series that is uh, this is the electrochemical series it is very important that is I am writing the electrochemical series that is the first element that is uh, lithium that is the value of lithium is minus 3.05 volts and Okay, this is electrochemical series. You can see the electrochemical series uh, from the picture. That is, uh, the first one is lithium, then potassium, then barium, then calcium, then sodium, then magnesium, then aluminium, then zinc, then iron, tin, lead, hydrogen, copper, mercury, silver, platinum, gold, and the fluorine. Is it clear? This is electrochemical series. It is very important. Uh, I think it is, uh, you can see that is lithium, potassium, barium, calcium, sodium, magnesium, aluminium, zinc, iron, tin, lead, hydrogen, copper, mercury, silver, platinum, gold and fluorine. And this is the electrochemical series. You must uh, find the values of lithium that is minus 3.05. And the value of hydrogen is we know that the potential of C is taken as 0 then it is 0 volt and the value of fluorine is that is uh, plus 2.87 volt and this values are very important that is the lithium is minus 3.05 and hydrogen is that is 0 volt and fluorine is 2.87 is a very important that is the value of fluorine is that is plus 2.87 
and the value of hydrogen is that is 0 volt and the value of hydro, uh, value of lithium is that is minus 3.05 so uh, you must understand the electrochemical series and electrochemical series is a an arrangement of various elements in the increasing order of their standard reduction potential the value of lithium is minus 3.5 and in increasing to 0 and then increasing to plus 2.87 that means the values are in the order of increasing that is the arrangement of various elements in the increasing order of their standard reduction potential is called electrochemical series and these are the elements in the electrochemical series okay are you ready and this is very important series uh, the elements are lithium, potassium, barium, calcium, sodium, magnesium, aluminium, zinc, iron, tin, lead, hydrogen, copper, mercury and silver, platinum, gold and fluorine. Okay. Then how to, uh, how to find this electrochemical series and how to remember this very easily. I will give you a shortcut. Are you ready? I will give you a shortcut to remember the electrochemical series. That is an English word. Okay. The word is very simple word that is word is that is uh, that is lit little this is the word little pop barry little pop barry canadian star made all zebra in town like his car this is the first word that is little pope barry canadian star made all zebra in town like his car my sister play golf and fencing and this is the word that is, if you uh, study this word, then you can easily uh, find out the electrochemical series. That is, little Pope Barry Canadian star made all zebra in town like his car. My sister play golf and fencing. Okay. That is, one more. That is, little Pope Barry Canadian star. Little Pope Barry Canadian star made all zebra in town like his car my sister play golf and fencing it's very simple little pope barry canadian star made all zebra in town like his car my sister play golf and fencing okay then little means this little means that is lithium little means lithium little means lithium okay that is little means lithium okay pope means potassium little means lithium little means lithium pope p means potassium that is k barry barry means barium barry means barium canadian that is calcium that is little means lithium pope means p that is potassium barry means barium Canadian means calcium star star is s that is s means that is sodium s is sodium made there are two m's are the the first m is magnesium and the second m is mercury made means made is magnesium made is magnesium all al that is aluminium zebra that is z z is zinc that is little means lithium pop p means potassium Barry, B A is barium, Canadian, C A means calcium, star, S means sodium, made, that is magnesium, all is aluminium, zebra is zinc, and in, I, I is iron, town, town means tin, tin is S N, like L, L is lead, and his, H is hydrogen, car is C, C is copper, is it clear? And next M is M is Mercury. M is Mercury. Sister. Sister is silver. Silver is AG. Play. Play is P. P is platinum. And golf. G is gold. And F is 
fluorine is clear this is the electrochemical series so you can uh, easily remember the electrochemical series by using this word that is little pope barry canadian star made all zebra in town like his car my sister play golf and fencing one more little pope barry canadian star made all zebra in town like his car my sister play golf and fencing little is lithium pop is potassium berry is barium canadium is calcium star is sodium made is magnesium all is aluminium zebra is zinc in is iron town is tin like lead hydrogen his is hydrogen car is copper my is mercury sister silver play is platinum golf is gold fencing is fluorine okay this is electrochemical series is very important because uh, there are a lot of questions are coming for the entrance examination okay little little is lithium pop is potassium barium means barium canadium means calcium star means sodium made means magnesium all means aluminium and uh, zebra means zinc in means iron tin uh, town like means lead his hydrogen car is copper my mercury sister is silver play is platinum golf means gold and fencing is it clear this is called electrochemical series the three values are very important that is lithium is uh, minus 3.05 and hydrogen is 0 0.00 volt that is 0 volt and fluorine is plus 2.87 and the other volts are not important but here i am giving the values uh, thus you can check in the ncrt textbook for the entrance reference here i am giving the values that is the value of uh, potassium is minus 2.93 and barium is minus 2.90 is not necessary to study and these are in the ncrt textbook and the calcium is minus 2.87 and i am uh, taking from the ncrt textbook that is sodium is minus 2.71 magnesium is minus 2.37 aluminium is minus 1.66 and zinc is minus 0.76 iron is minus 0.44 and tin is minus 0.14 and lead is minus 0.13 okay and hydrogen is zero and uh, copper is plus 0.34 mercury is plus 0.79 plus 0.80 and 1.20 and uh, 1.50 and the series is called as that is electrochemical series and the series is called the series is called as what that is called electrochemical series what is electrochemical series electrochemical series is the arrangement of various elements in the increasing order of their standard reduction potential is called as electrochemical series Electrochemical series is the arrangement of various elements in the increasing order of their standard reduction potential is called electrochemical series. The electrochemical series or EMF series can be easily uh, studied by the shortcut that is the dialogue that is little Pope Barry Canadian star made all zebra in town like his car my sister play golf and fencing you must study the values of lithium that is minus 3.05 hydrogen is 0 and fluorine is plus 2.87 is it clear and here i am giving an important uh, notes for entrance examinate these are very important for entrance and this is very very important points is it clear okay check this the most negative reduction potential is for that is lithium that is more negative reduction potential is for for lithium and more positive reduction more positive reduction potential for fluorine is it clear the more negative reduction potential is for lithium and more positive reduction potential is for fluorine any doubt no doubt from this i am giving an important point that is if the reduction potential is more negative if the reduction potential is more negative then they are then they are strong reducing agent is it clear this is the most important point 
that is if the electrode potential is more negative then that electrode is strong reducing agent it is the most important point if the electrode potential is more negative then that electrode is a strong reducing agent is it clear if the electrode potential is more negative if the electrode potential is more negative then it is strong reducing agent okay is it clear for i am taking lithium potassium barium and calcium which is more strong reducing agent that is lithium has more negative reduction potential and lithium is the strongest reducing agent is it clear more negative potential uh, reduction potential then it is strong reducing agent and the next point is that is more positive reduction potential then it is strong oxidizing agent strong oxidizing agent the value of reduction potential is more positive then it is strong oxidizing agent any doubt any doubt if the electrode potential value is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent any doubt any doubt no that is if the electrode potential value is more negative then it is strong reducing agent if the electrode potential value is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent that's the point i am writing here that is if reduction potential value if the reduction potential value reduction potential value is more negative more negative if the reduction potential value is more negative then it is a strong reducing age is it clear if the electrode potential is more negative then it is strong reducing agent if the electrode potential value is more negative if the electrode potential value is 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 more negative is the most important point if the electrode potential value is more negative then it is act as a strong reducing agent then it act as a strong reducing agent is it clear any doubt no and the next point and the next point is if the reduction potential value if the reduction potential value reduction potential value is more positive more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent is also very important point if the electrode potential value is more positive electrode potential value is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent then it is a strong oxidizing agent okay that is i am right giving an another point that is if the electrode potential value is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent that is if the electrode potential value is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent then it is a strong oxidizing agent then it undergo undergo a reduction is it clear is it clear that is if the electrode potential value is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent they undergo reduction if the electrode potential value is more negative then it is a strong reducing agent undergo 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 oxidation ready ready that is lithium is a strong reducing agent but lithium undergo oxidation fluorine is a strong oxidizing agent but it undergo reduction i am giving an another entrance point that is electrode potential value is more negative then it is a strong reducing agent is it clear if the reduction potential value is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent is it clear then i am giving an another point that is if the electrode potential value is more positive if the reduction potential value is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent that is it will undergo reduction is it clear that is the third point 
if the reduction potential value if the reduction potential value is more positive if the reduction potential value is more positive if the reduction potential value is more positive are you ready if the electrode potential value is more positive the electrode potential value is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent oxidizing agent is it clear as we already said is that the reduction potential value is more positive then it is a strong reducing agent is it clear okay here if the reduction potential value is more positive then it is a strong reducing agent that means it will undergo it will undergo reduction is it clear that is if the reduction potential value is more positive then it is a strong reducing agent but it will undergo but it will undergo but it will undergo undergo reduction ready it will undergo reduction if it undergo reduction means reduction means it will it will gain electron it will gain electron is it clear gain electron means it will gain electron means gain electron from other element is it clear if it gain electron means gain electron from other element that means that means other elements other elements other elements loss electron is it clear other elements loss electron other elements loss electron means other elements other elements undergo oxidation other elements undergo oxidation ready hence other elements undergo oxidation means other elements undergo oxidation means this is a strong oxidizing H. is it clear how to get oxidizing agent is it clear that is if the reduction potential value is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent how to get it is an oxidizing agent that is it will if the electrode potential value is more positive then it undergo reduction undergo reduction means it will gain electron is it clear it will gain electron gain electron from where it gain electron from other element that means other elements will lose electron that means other elements undergo oxidation hence it is a strong oxidizing agent is it clear similarly we can say that if the electrode potential value is more negative hence it is a strong reducing agent reducing agent means it undergo oxidation that means it lost electron is it clear it lost electron to they gain by another electron the other elements undergo uh, what oxidation hence it is a strong reducing agent simply okay the first point is if the reduction potential value is more negative then it is a strong reducing agent if the reduction potential value is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent is it clear this is other about the idea of that is electrochemical series what is electrochemical series electrochemical series is the arrangement of various elements in the increasing order of their standard reduction potential lithium has least reduction potential that is negative 3.05 and more negative reduction potential is for fluorine that is plus 2.87 the reduction potential of c that is hydrogen is taken as zero is it clear if the reduction potential is more negative then it is a strong reducing agent if the reduction potential is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent if the electrode potential is more positive then it is strong oxidizing agent but it will undergo reduction if the redu uh, reduction potential value is more negative then it under uh, they are are strong reducing agent but it will undergo oxidation okay you will get an overall idea of electrochemical series is it clear these are the basic idea of electrochemical series okay you know the word that is little pop barry canadian star made all zebra in town like his car my sister play golf and 
fencing from this word you can easily remember that is electrochemical series electrochemical series is the arrangement of various elements in the increasing order of uh, uh, standard reduction potential that is you can also say that it is the decreasing order of standard reduction potential also an electrochemical series is it clear okay if the electrode potential value is more negative then it is a strong reducing agent if the reduction potential value is more positive then it is a strong oxidizing agent this is the basic overview of electrochemical series okay please check it this is electrochemical series Any, any doubt no next i am moving to the next topic that is the characteristics of electrochemicals it is very important that is characteristics of characteristics of electrochemical series is a very important topic that is the characteristics of electrochemical series are you ready it is also a very important topic is also very important okay let us start the characteristics of electrochemical series the first characteristics okay please go to the electrochemical series this is the electrochemical series from this you can identify that in the top of the series the elements such as lithium potassium barium calcium sodium magnesium etc that is in the top of the electrochemical series the elements such as lithium potassium barium calcium sodium magnesium etc all are s block elements any doubt no that is the in the top of the series lithium potassium barium calcium etc all are s block elements the property of the s block element is they readily lose electron to form cation because in their valence electron in the first group elements like lithium sodium etc they have only one electron in their valence shell to attain the noble gas electronic configuration they readily lose electrons is it clear that is lithium potassium barium calcium sodium magnesium etc all are s block elements hence they are readily lose electron to attain the nearest noble gas electronic configuration to lose their uh, valence electron hence they are they have a strong electro positive character is it clear the s block elements have strong electro positive character from this i can identify that the first characteristic is in the top of the series the elements are elements have strong electro positive character is it clear is it clear that is the first characteristic is the first characteristic is that is strong strongly electro positive strongly electro positive is it clear that is lithium sodium potassium etc have strong electro positive character and so we can say that the strongly electro positive otherwise we can say that weakly electro negative strongly electro positive elements have weakly electro negative character strongly electro negative characters have weakly electro positive character is it clear strongly electro positive otherwise we can say that that is weakly electro negative that is strongly electro positive or weakly electro negative elements present in the present in the top of the series is it clear is it clear the first characteristics of the electrochemical series that is strongly electro positive or weakly electro negative elements are present in the top of the series and they they readily form cation why they form cation because they have only one or two electrons in their valence cell to attain the nearest noble gas electron configuration they lose electron hence they form cation is it clear this is the first characteristics of electrochemical series that is 
In the top of the series, they are strongly electropositive or weakly electronegative. This is the first characteristics. Okay. And we are moving to the next second characteristics is it is the most important and it is the most important characteristics is it is the most important characteristics among the characteristics of electrochemical series that is in the top of the series in the top of the series they are in the top of the series they are strongly electropositive also it is a weakly electronegative Hence, we can say that the second characteristic is the weakly electronegative elements present in the top of the series can displace strongly electronegative element present in the bottom of the series from their salt solution. It is the most important characteristic that is in the top of the series the elements are strongly electropositive or weakly electronegative in the bottom of the series the fluorine is a strongly electronegative hence we can say that the weakly electronegative elements present in the top of the series can easily displace strongly electronegative element present in the bottom of the series from the salt solution is it clear it is the most important characteristics that is the second characteristic is it is the most important one that is weakly electronegative weakly electronegative elements present in the top of the series weakly electronegative element present in the top of the series can displace can displace strongly electro negative elements in the bottom of the series from their salt solution it is a most important property or characteristics among the uh, characteristics of electrochemical series is the weakly electronegative element present in the top of the series can displace strongly electronegative element present in the bottom of the series from their salt solution. Simply we can say that the top elements can displace uh, bottom elements from their salt solution. The top elements means uh, element present in the top of the series can displace element present in the bottom of the series from their salt solution. That's the most important point that is the element present in the top of the series can displace element present in the bottom of the series from their salt solution. Okay, this is the most important point and I am highlighting this point. Okay. This is the most important point. Hence, uh, I am highlighting this point. So, that is the weakly electronegative element present in the top of the series. Weakly electronegative element present in the top of the series can displace, can displace strongly electronegative elements. Strongly electronegative element present in the bottom of the series from their salt solution okay i am giving an example for you okay first i'm highlighting this because it is a very 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 important point okay yes i am giving an example from this you can easily understand that the element present in the top of the series can displace element present in the bottom of the series from their salt solution is it clear okay i am giving an example that is example that is element present in the top of the series. I am taking an ex element that is uh, an example is I am taking uh, zinc and copper. I am taking zinc and copper. We know that uh, zinc in the top and copper from the bottom and zinc can displace copper from copper sulfate solution. Okay. I can say I can say that is zinc can displace copper from copper sulfate solution why because zinc on the top and copper from the bottom that is top elements can displace bottom elements from their salt solution that is zinc displace 
copper from copper sulfate solution. I am giving one more example that is uh, I am taking the electrochemical series that is uh, here I am taking iron and copper here iron on the top and copper on the bottom then cyan can displace copper from copper sulfate solution that is the second example is iron can displace copper from copper sulfate solution if I am taking a uh, copper and silver then what is the if I am taking copper and silver here copper is here copper is here and silver is here then copper displays silver from silver salt solution that is silver nitrate solution <coughs> if I am taking copper and silver then copper this is copper copper displays copper can displays copper can displays silver from silver nitrate solution as goes on that is the top element that is element present on the top of the series can displace element present on the bottom of the series from their salt solution it is the most important characteristics is that is the weakly electronegative element present in the top of the series can displace strongly electronegative element present in the bottom of the series from their salt solution is it clear is it clear okay we are moving to the third one the third characteristics is the third characteristics is the elements present above hydrogen element present above hydrogen are easily rusted that is element present above hydrogen that is metal present above hydrogen are easily rusted but elements below hydrogen are not easily rusted is it clear this is the third characteristics that is in the electrochemical series in the electrochemical series the element present above hydrogen are easily rusted but the element present the below hydrogen in the electrochemical series are not easily rusted is it clear is it clear this is my third characteristics any doubt and the fourth one is and the fourth one is the hydroxides of hydroxides of metal hydroxides of metal present in the present in the top of the series top of the series are strongly basic strongly basic do not undergo hydrolysis this is the point that is the metal present in the top of the series form hydroxide which are strongly basic do not undergo hydrolysis that is hydroxides of the metal present in the top of the series are strongly basic do not undergo hydrolysis but the elements present in the bottom of the series are weakly basic and they undergo hydrolysis and the last one that is uh, metals present above hydrogen metal present above hydrogen can displace can displace hydrogen from dilute acids this is the fifth characteristics that is metal present on the above hydrogen can displace hydrogen from the dilute acid this can be easily identified from the, the second characteristic that is element present on the top of the series can displace uh, element present on the bottom of the series the same idea is given here that is metals above hydrogen can displace hydrogen from their dilute acids is it clear these are the characteristics of electrochemical series the worst characteristics is that is strongly electropositive or weakly electronegative element present in the top of the series uh, 
they have they readily form cation and the second one is weakly electronegative element present in the top of the series can displace strongly electronegative elements in the bottom of the series from their salt solution it is the most important care and the third one is element present above hydrogen are easily rusted but elements below hydrogen are not easily rusted the hydroxides of the metal present in the top of the series are strongly basic and do not undergo hydrolysis and metal present in the above hydrogen can displace hydrogen from dilute acid is it clear these are the characteristics of electrochemical series next we are moving to the applications of electrochemical series are you ready okay mm -hmm.